they always end up here. Uh. Hmm. Someone is making the most of his stay. Can you blame the man? I'd say he's not ordering enough. Tools and accessories for masterful prestidigitation. Or, or weapons and defenses against visitors from the great beyond. <laughs> Ah, 
Such a shame that Inspector Pasido vanished. I'd feel much safer with him handling this. Okay. Uh, no. I need more clues. I am needed elsewhere. Found this chip ring with a multi sign. Do I need to? No, 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 no. I need to go. No, 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 no. I need to go. Are you able to help me? Oh, I'm sorry, but that's beyond my knowledge. Guests noticed him. Okay. May I ask you something? You are fortunate to ask me because I know that. Oh, I found a witness who advised that Lord Craven spent only a short time in the bar after he left the Sian. <laughs> ah. Pardon, Monsieur, but I am nah. not in the mood to talk. No, no, no. Can you satisfy my curiosity? Ex excuse me? What? I'm not sure I know. Okay. Do you know anything about this? Uh, d don't take it personally, sir. Uh, but I know nothing about this. You obviously haven't thought this all through. Or are you just annoying these people on purpose? Um, 
Is this familiar to you? I have nothing to hide, sir, but I've never heard of this. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah, I can ask Bartender. This. Wait. Would you like another? No. Would you like another? Oh. Is that? May I ask for your assistance? I would never deny you, sir, but I know nothing about this. <laughs> Such a shame that Inspector Posido vanished. I'd feel much safer with him handling this. Can you assist me? Oh, yeah. Are you able to help me? I have nothing to hide, sir, but I've never no. heard of this. Hmm. I need to ask, is it true they hurt him? I sadly. Maybe I should post this. He did it. Okay. Uh, this one. That's a remarkable pin of yours, Mr. Galici. Does it have any meaning? The butterfly? It's a reminder of a time in which I was truly happy. What a coincidence. Lady Craven had a ring with the same design. A coincidence indeed. <laughs> I suspect it is a common theme in jewellery. Ah. This is all just a big misunderstanding. The spirits confirm it. Ah. I am needed elsewhere. Yeah, yeah. Need to this one. Okay. The mother had time to kill Emma while Lord Raven was drinking downstairs. Hey, it's not you. This is. I don't know. <laughs> uh, the thief that stolen from Lord Craven on his trip was setting up the servant to cover the track. So. If I do this, ah, na 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 na, na. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Raven cannot 
control his temper and has the money and influence to escape punishment. I must bring him to justice. Raven pray, Raven fell prey to the professional criminal. Even Emma check us. The killing was an act of self-defense. I am needed elsewhere. Okay. I am needed elsewhere. <laughs> no, 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 no. I need to ask him something. Uh... Stop wasting time. The murderer is getting away. Uh... Get to the point, Mr. Holmes. Stop wasting time. The murderer is getting away. I doubt I can help with this. I doubt I can help with this. Stop wasting time. The murderer is getting away. Do you recognize this ring? Should I? That's a third-rate piece if ever I've seen one. I'd never buy something like this. Did you ever see Miss Emma wearing it? No. And why should she? I gave her enough jewelry that she could wear a superior ring every day of the week. Okay. I doubt I can help with this. Stop wasting time. The murderer is getting away. Get to the point, Mr. Holmes. I doubt I can help with this. I found these jewels secreted away. Are you familiar with them? Ah, it cannot be so. That deceptive wagtail. How could she do this? That sounds like a yes. These items were supposedly stolen from us during our trip. I must have spent hours reporting it all to the police. And it turns out she had them all along. The trollop. I'd kill her myself were she not dead already. Oh. I cannot cover for you, Lord Craven. The facts are conclusive. You murdered your mistress. It wasn't me. You have no proof. Not a whit. You entered the room just as Miss Emma was hiding the diamond. Discovering that she was the thief was the final straw. Preposterous! I didn't know a thing about it until you showed me her stash. A couple of whiskies go down fast for an alcoholic. That left you plenty of time for murder. That's ridiculous. I am no alcoholic. And there are witnesses who will attest I was there for at least a quarter of an hour. You have bruised knuckles and you look a mess. The poor woman fought for her life, and you bear all the evidence. This whole evening was a mess. You know I got into a scuffle with the medium in the seance room. Nothing has changed since then. There's plenty of proof, sir. The police would certainly arrest you. You scoundrel. You said you would help me. I had nothing to do with it, as you will soon see. Ah. Uh. There is a more charitable interpretation. Miss Emma was a thief of unsavory character. Perhaps she threatened you, forced you to fight for your life. Are you... <laughs> you suggest I lie to the police? Escape blind justice? Your lover was a corrupting influence. She stole from you, lied to you, and drove you to violence. You deserve a second chance. If you apply yourself and some of your wealth, you could do a great deal of good outside of jail. I will tell the police what I learned about Miss Emma, and no more. Well, even if you don't believe I'm innocent, you've given me a chance to prove it. Thank you for staying on my side. Oh. I don't know. Gentlemen, when this matter is resolved, I'll see to it you are sacked. This treatment is unbecoming for a man of my status. Mr. Holmes, you are my witness. Look at him. The murderer playing the indignant victim. He should be a politician. He certainly has the means. I hope he also possesses the character to do better and do good.
That was too much fun, Sherry. I'm buzzing. Buzzing. Wasn't it fun? A woman died, John. I was too slow to the truth, too hesitant to intervene. How can you... Oh, lighten up. Those people made their choices. If you swan about with a diamond in your pocket, that's what happens. Wealth is a weakness, so we must blame those who covet it. With enough money on the line, Sherlock, a man will do just about anything, even murder, and then we get to solve it. I suspect you perhaps cannot grasp the true horrors of mortality, John. Oi, I am aware of my perilous existence, thank you very much. Hmm. I must admit, even if the outcome of the adventure was imperfect, there was some pleasure to be had in the puzzle. Well, Cordona seems more depraved and decadent than we thought. I bet you'll get another chance. A bet, you say? A uh, figure of speech. Just a figure of speech. Ah, damn. Well, take one last look at the view, then we must be off. It's time to do what we came here for. A free ride for every hotel visitor. Just tell me where to go. Everything all right. If you don't feel up to it, I won't tell anyone. It's just a goodbye, John. It won't be difficult. I've already come to terms with my mother's passing. Hmm. So you really don't remember? To what do you refer? Funeral. Sherlock, you were distraught. At first, I thought this visit would dredge up those feelings, but you've been remarkably level. John, I think I was too young to understand. I couldn't fathom why she would leave them. Perhaps that pain is best left forgotten. On the contrary, it's why I'm visiting her grave. To remember her. Oh. 